So when you think about child abuse, um, it can come at any time, and it can come from a lot of different directions. It can come in just a regular patient visit that you see. And an example that I have is a patient that I was seeing for iron deficiency anemia. It was going to be a quick 10-minute checkup. I always check for bruising, and so I looked at the patient's arms and legs, and when I looked at the arms, I saw the marks from cutting. Um, and that led to then questions of, do you cut? Yes, I do. Do you feel safe at home? No, I don't. <laughs> and, and then that whole visit took a very different turn. But if you don't look and if you don't ask, you don't find. So it's important to not take anything for granted. Um, the fact that you have seen that patient before, the fact that many other physicians may have seen the patient before should not matter. The data about the incidence of child abuse is stunning, and so you can't let your guard down. You always gotta be on the lookout for it. If we can recognize the early events as child abuse is escalating, we have a chance to get that child out of that situation or potentially turn the parent's behavior around to stop and intervene.